Wireless Fire Alarms, EN54 Part 25 Over the last five years, wireless fire alarms have improved immensely and the fire code BS5839 Part 1 has had to try and keep pace with the progress in the technology of wireless fire alarm systems. However, as of March 2011, all compliant wireless fire alarm systems must comply with the new code EN54 Part 25. This code is now the standard for all wireless fire alarms across Europe. This new standard was established to ensure that wireless fire alarms provide the same level of protection as their wired co counterparts. The EN54 Part 25 is an improvement to what was expected in BS5839. The new standard has made many major changes to the way wireless fire alarms operate, such as introduction of bi-directional communication, dual battery backup, sources, improved fault monitoring and a defined product testing procedure. The frequency now dedicated to wireless fire alarms is 868 MHz. All the compliant systems on the market in the UK have now moved to this frequency. The old frequency used by many manufacturers used to be 468 MHz. The lower frequency of 468 MHz did have some advantages of providing you with a larger signal range than the 868 MHz. However, the big disadvantage of the 868 MHz bandwidth is that it's very congested with such items as wireless car alarm fobs, baby alarms, remote controls, etc. With the new EN54 now in place, it is important to ensure that if you are considering buying a wireless fire alarm system, it is important that the installer does not mislead you into purchasing a system that is not EN54 compliant. So what manufacturers are currently complying with EN54? Well, there are currently five wireless fire alarm manufacturers that I know of. Hi-Fi from Sterling Safety Systems, Firecell EMS, The Zero Plus from Electro Detectors, Radio Plus from Fully and Cooper, and Detectomat. I've carried out some research, and what I have discovered, it would appear that only three are fully compliant under all sections of EN54 Part 25. They are the Hi-Fi range from Sterling Safety Systems, the fire cell range from EMS and the Zero Plus range from Electro Detectors EDA. The Radio Plus from Fullion, the new panel or system that's come out recently, is currently going through third party approval. I have been informed by Fullion that they expect to get approval in the first quarter of 2013. The Hi Fi range, which entered into the market in 2005, has always been EN54 compliant and operating at the 868 MHz frequency. EMS used to have a wireless range called Firepoint 5000, or still have that, that range, operating at 468 MHz. But due to the enforcement of the EN54 Part 25, they've had to redesign their wireless fire alarm system and brought to the market their new range called the Fire Cell. This range is EN54 compliant. EDA had an old range called Millennium, then they brought out a new wireless panel called the Zero, which was launched in 2004. However, like EMS, the Millennium and the first Zero panel did not comply with EN54. Therefore, the Zero Plus was introduced to comply with the standard. To make sure you get the right radio fire alarm, why not contact the specialist in this field? Fire Systems Limited specialise in all types of wireless fire alarms and are able to design, install and maintain all types of wireless fire alarm systems. We also carry out wireless fire alarm maintenance and servicing on wired systems. For more information, why not give us a call on 0208 541 5646 or visit our website on www.firesystems.co.uk.